Have you ever wondered why, despite everything we know today, there are still people who believe the Earth is flat? Join us as we explore the origins of this fascinating theory, the reasons so many people defend it, and the secrets behind a movement that challenges one of the most basic understandings of science. In a world where technology allows us to observe space and understand complex phenomena, it may seem strange that some people still doubt something as fundamental as the shape of the Earth. Yet the so-called Flat Earth Movement remains alive, with thousands convinced that everything we've been told about our planet's shape is a lie. Could it be that the truth has been hidden by those in power? Or is it simply a rebellion against modern science? Origins of the idea. A flat world in ancient times. The belief that the Earth is flat is nothing new. Thousands of years ago, without advanced technology or scientific knowledge, many ancient civilizations assumed the world stretched out flat beneath their feet. Cultures like the ancient Mesopotamians, Egyptians and others pictured the Earth as a disk surrounded by a vast ocean. When people looked toward the horizon and saw a straight line, it seemed obvious that there was no curvature to the land. As knowledge and observation advanced, Greek philosophers like Pythagoras and Aristotle began to propose the idea of a round Earth. Pythagoras observed that during eclipses, the shadow cast on the moon was round. And Aristotle noticed that as one moved north or south, the stars visible in the sky changed. These revolutionary ideas were the first steps toward astronomical science and the understanding of our planet's spherical shape. Science gains ground but doubts linger over centuries. Knowledge about the Earth's shape solidified. Explorers like Christopher Columbus and Ferdinand Magellan who sailed in opposite directions demonstrated through their voyages that the Earth has no edge at the horizon. Over time, the idea of a spherical Earth became globally accepted. Yet centuries later, the idea of a flat Earth re-emerged. In the 19th century, when scientific knowledge was already much more advanced, an Englishman named Samuel Robotham revived the idea of a flat Earth. With a simple experiment, observing that distant objects did not disappear beyond the horizon, Robotham concluded the Earth must be flat. Although this proof was flawed, it caught the attention of people who, amid the Industrial Revolution, were starting to doubt science and progress. The Modern Resurgence Why do some still believe in a flat Earth? In the digital age, the flat Earth theory has found fertile ground to make a comeback. In 2004, a man named Daniel Shenton reignited the Flat Earth Society bringing together people convinced that the idea of a round Earth was part of a massive conspiracy. According to Flat Earth believers, governments, scientists, and agencies like NASA are all in on this lie, hiding the true nature of our planet. To Flat Earthers, direct experience is a strong argument. By looking at the horizon or observing the ocean, they say the lack of visible curvature indicates the Earth is flat. Although modern science explains that the Earth's curvature is difficult to perceive at ground level due to its large scale, these explanations do not convince those who believe scientists are hiding the truth. How Flat Earthers Explain Natural Phenomena If the Earth were flat, 
All the natural phenomena we observe would have to be explained in a completely different way. Flat earthers have their own answers for each of these phenomena. And while their ideas are not scientifically backed, they offer a curious glimpse into their worldview. Horizon without visible curvature. Flat earthers argue that the horizon simply marks the limit of our vision, and that if the earth were round, curvature would be evident even at sea level. Day and night cycle. According to this theory, the sun would move in circles above the earth's surface, illuminating different areas as it moves. However, this explanation fails to account for changes in day length or seasonal variations. Gravity. This is one of the most questioned points. Rather than gravity, flat earthers propose that the earth is constantly moving upward, keeping us grounded. Modern physics, however, contradicts this idea as constant acceleration would not account for many observable phenomena, such as objects falling from different heights. These interpretations defy science in several ways, yet flat earthers believe that any counter-arguments are simply part of the conspiracy. The science and evidence confirming Earth's roundness. For centuries, Science has provided conclusive evidence confirming that Earth is a sphere. Observations and experiments have been repeated time and again and the evidence is abundant. Images from space. With the launch of the satellite Explorer 1 in 1958, the first images of Earth from space clearly showed its roundness. Since then, Thousands of images and videos have captured the Earth's curvature, changing stars in different hemispheres. As we travel from one hemisphere to another, the stars and constellations we see change. This phenomenon can only be explained if we are on a spherical surface that affects our viewing angle. Gravitational force. Gravity, one of nature's fundamental forces, acts uniformly in all directions toward Earth's center. If Earth were flat, this force would not distribute evenly, and we'd feel a stronger pull toward the center than toward the edges. Despite this overwhelming evidence, flat Earth believers continue to argue that all this data is part of a grand deception. The psychology behind belief why insist on a flat Earth? At this point, you may wonder, what motivates flat Earthers to defend this belief? For many, the idea of a flat Earth is about more than physical shape. It's a way of rebelling against conventional ideas. In a time when trust in institutions has declined, the idea of hidden truth has a unique appeal. This psychological phenomenon, known as conspiracy theory, creates a strong sense of belonging among believers. For them, being part of the Flat Earth Movement represents being part of a minority that knows the real truth, in contrast to others who are deceived. This reinforces their sense of fighting against the system, a narrative that gives people purpose. Social media and the spread of ideas in the age of post-truth. With the rise of social media, flat earth theories have found the perfect medium for spreading. Videos, forums, discussion groups, and posts on platforms like YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter have allowed this belief to gain followers worldwide. This has led to a phenomenon known as post-truth, where emotions and personal beliefs seem more important than scientific facts. For some, 
Belief in a flat earth is just one example of how technology can allow the spread of baseless ideas. But for others, it represents a way of questioning those who hold the power of knowledge and control of information. A debate beyond Earth's shape. While the idea of a flat Earth may seem far-fetched, its persistence invites us to reflect on something deeper. The relationship between knowledge and society, trust in institutions, and the power of beliefs in an increasingly connected world. Ultimately, the debate over a flat Earth reminds us of the importance of questioning but also of grounding our beliefs in solid evidence and humanity's accumulated knowledge. Curiosity and a desire to understand the world are natural. And if there's one lesson this fascinating movement teaches us, it's that there will always be questions and people seeking answers, even if their theories challenge everything we know.